This clip will illustrate four different methods of adding road vertical alignment in Roadmaker software. In Roadmaker, we assume you already have your .xx1, .pid and .gro files loaded. If you do not know how to do that, watch the clip on single road design. The first method. This method is used for a new vertical alignment design. Start by selecting via line. This adds alignment at the ground level from start to end of the long section. Then I add a VPI point with a VPI, indicate a point between two existing PI points and add the point where I want it. Give the PI a vertical curve length and tick the box recalculate. Right click on the screen and the program will refresh the long section graphics. Continue to add, edit or delete the VPI points as you require. Second method. We enter the vertical alignment as the existing alignment from design data given to us. Select data, long section, alignment left. We first clear the existing information. Enter the information you received using the tab key to go through the different columns and to the next empty line. Important, on the last line, tap through to the next empty line to let the program finish calculating the last line, beginning of curve and end of curve. OK and view the alignment. If you made any mistakes, go back and correct them. Remember to tap through a line again if you need to recalculate. Third method, even while you have existing alignment loaded. This method will be in a situation where you do a rehabilitation of an existing road and want to start off by using the existing profile of the road. Go to data, long section, ground, Copy to alignment. Select the left carriageway. In this case I make the length 50 meters to try and eliminate the sharp points on the long section profile. Redo the function or continue to add, edit or delete the VPI points that was added. Fourth method. We use this method to import a vertical alignment from an ASCII file. Select File, Import, Defined ASCII Data. Go to File Open. Browse to the file and open it. Change the Select Entity to Import to a vertical alignment. On the format sequence, type the sequence in the order of the file data. Read from line 2 to ignore the heading and comma separated. Select OK to load the file. Do a replot on the main screen to view the result. To save the vertical alignment, go to File, Save. The extension of the design file is .pr3. Save the design file with the same name as the .xx1, .gro and .pid files. 